There you go. All strapped in. Is it better? Or is it about the same? Do you notice a difference when I turn the vibration on? Is that different? Whoa. <laughs> How does that feel? Are you chilling out now? <laughs> Does that mellow you out? Tell us how you feel. What if I turn it off? Whoa, what happened to it? I can't have you too chilled out, otherwise you can't do your playtime. You can't play with your toys. Whoa! Got it. <gasps> Got it. Ready? Got it. Got it. Yeah. Which one are you going to go for? All of them. Keep losing your blanket. I think you're ready for a bouncer. You're just not you're just not strong enough yet, but we can improvise. Yeah. Do you want to play with your toys? Boop. Pretty uninterested in the toys. You're more interested in me, which I'm flattered. I feel like that's probably going to change soon, but that's okay. It's part of becoming a kid. I guess you're already a kid. You're a baby kid. This is your foot. And this is your other foot. Uh-huh. This is your left foot. This is your right foot. This is your left hand. This is your right hand. This is Minnie Mouse, and she is laying on your belly. But in real life, Sailor Bear, if you have a mouse on your belly, you need to tell me. Because we, know, we live next to a cow pasture, and so there's field mice, bless you. And sometimes they get in our yard. You got some bubbles. Let me bub let me do bubble there. Oh, still got one. And usually the professor and Lexi will take care of the mice for us, but sometimes sometimes they might not, and one might get on your belly when you're playing in the yard. And you should probably not let it stay on your belly. But they're not like really gross. They're not like rats, you know. They're just mice. They're just field mice. And they play with the cows. Lexi likes to play with the cows, but we we don't let her go out there anymore. Are you ready for the next toy? Or are you ready for a nap? <gasps> next toy. Okay, I'm ready. All right, let's do it. 